hotties and welcome back to my crazy ass channel. How are y'all doing today? I hope you're doing absolutely amazing. Welcome to my last create a sim ever. Basically my entire mods folder is up and I have to delete every single thing in there. It's jumbled. It's crazy and it makes my game so laggy. So this is going to be the last creative sim that I do with all these mods. And then I finally get to wipe everything. But since this is my last creative sim, I feel like I have to go absolutely crazy and make the most stunning, insane, unique looking sim I've ever made. And then when I finally delete my mods folder and get some new CC, that will obviously be a video too. So make sure that you stay tuned for that. But before this video starts out, this video is actually sponsored by Discord. This video is sponsored by Discord. If you don't know what Discord is, it's an amazing app that allows you to connect with people that have similar interests with you. While you can do fun stuff like chatting in different channels, talking in voice chats, and meeting friends all over the world. I have my own server over at discord.gg forward slash Carmen, and it really helps me connect with you guys and find out what kind of stuff you guys are doing in The Sims, what kind of videos you want to see, and we can also just have cute combos. My server is obviously very very pink and very girly. I have my own stickers, reaction rules, and a lot of customization to my server. Whenever you use Discord, you can truly make it your own, which is why it's my absolute favorite platform. Make sure you come in and show me all of the sims that you've made. Signing up to Discord is also extremely easy to so stop getting left out of all the fun and make sure you join my server today. Thank you so much, Discord. I love you. Now, this sim, okay, this is literally like a base sim. I haven't touched her at all, but she's covered in stuff. She got her white toe polish. She has some body glow, some contacts, and then a little face mask on top. I cannot take any of this stuff off. Like my game is so broken that it's just here, but I guess I'll just start by like sculpting her face. I really don't know what kind of look we're going for today. I think I definitely want to do some dramatic makeup look because Euphoria is about to come out and oh my God. I loved the first season of Euphoria, especially the eye makeup looks. They were unbelievably beautiful. Ooh, this eye shape is actually very pretty. Um, so I cannot wait until I see all of the new eye looks in the second season of Euphoria. But I'm also kind of scared because I feel like a lot of stuff is going to go down in this season. And I don't know if I'm ready to cry on my computer screen at three in the morning every single night. But it's whatever. It's whatever. So I've really been struggling to play The Sims lately, mainly because all that I do is play GTA roleplay on Twitch. Like I literally eat, sleep, breathe GTA roleplay. So other games have just been very dry to me because I feel like I'm really lacking that kind of social aspect because, you know, in GTA, you're are kind of forced to talk to people and like do this do that da, 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 da. and i don't know in sims i feel like i'm so lazy like you want me to control you and give you your own life where is the pizzazz where is the judge like i feel like in the sims 2 and the sims 3 it was so unpredictable you never knew what your sims were gonna get into you never knew if your sims were gonna cheat have a baby with somebody else have a want to like start a fucking fire in their bathroom. You just never know with The Sims. And I feel like it's just very lacking in The Sims 4. Like nothing really happens, at least to me in my game, that is unpredictable. I feel like I've literally done every single thing possible to do. And every single time some new DLC comes out, I'm like, oh my God, this is going to be it. This is going to be the change that I need and I cannot wait. And then it flops and I literally never play it again. Oh my God, wait, this eye color and this eye shape, are you fucking stupid? She's beautiful, oh my God. Yeah, I'm still one of those bitches that is very hopeful for The Sims 5, like every single day when I open up Twitter, when I wake up, I'm like, where's Sims 5 announcement? Like, come on, we need it. But then a lot of my friends and people that I know that play Sims are like, listen, Sims 5 is not gonna change shit. We're just gonna have another empty game. You're gonna have to buy pets all over again. You're gonna have to buy seasons all over again. And the way that I see it is I personally do not mind paying for a pack as long as I feel like it's worth it. You know what I mean? Like if the pack is amazing, it has a lot of features to play around with and I can see myself playing it all the time. I don't mind spending that money. But if the pack is going to be dry and missing a lot of key features, oh, hell no. That's when we're going to fight. So I don't know. I'm definitely still trying to be positive and think that The Sims 5 is going to, you know, hopefully come within the next year. Hello. I don't think that's going to be realistic. But like I said, I'm trying to be hopeful. 
And I hope that when it does come out, it's gonna fulfill a lot of our wishes. Like personally, I know a lot of people are against multiplayer. They don't care for it. They don't wanna see it. They just wanna keep their Sims game, you know, single player to themselves. And I think that's totally fine. But I don't know. I really, really, really wanna see some multiplayer aspect in the Sims 5, or even if it's like a spin-off game that's not even like Sims 5, Sims whatever. Like what if it's a completely new game? I will not care as long as there's a multiplayer element. But anyways, enough ranting. This Sim is very beautiful so far. But I don't know. I keep seeing all of these TikToks where the Sims look so extremely realistic. And I'm like, I don't understand. Is this like a filter? Do y'all have like some new magic CC that I've never seen before? Or how do I get my Sims to look like this? Because I feel like my Sim obviously looks gorgeous and she definitely has like alpha CC and stuff like that on her, but she doesn't look as realistic as the other Sims I'm seeing. Like, what am I doing wrong? <laughs> oh my God, she's very pretty, but maybe I can like layer some skin layers on top of one another that might help out Ooh, what if i do like some shorter hair i literally never do that with my female sims so that could be a look she actually like really suits short hair face really suits it oh my god wait i think this hairstyle really suits her help the way I clicked it by accident, but it was like the best decision I ever made. Oh my God. Mm, no, I think now that I've seen the short hair, that's definitely the one that's winning me over. Okay, how do I do this? Length, short, and then we'll go into custom content. This looks like she took scissors herself. <laughs> okay, I found it, you guys, but I changed my mind. I was gonna go with this hair at first, but I don't know. Something about this is just like, I don't know, it looks so perfect on her. And now it's just like finding a color. Oh, I don't know, is it like too much if I match the eyeshadow with the hair? Oh my God, she looks so beautiful. Oh, wait, why is the yellow giving? Is that too much? Oh my God, why am I like so scared right now? Oh my God, she looks so pretty. Oh my God, this pink is super cute too. Why is this so hard to pick? Literally every color looks good on her. Oh my God. Okay, every color except this red. I'm not a fan, but literally I could go with any other color and I'd love it. I think I'm gonna go with, yeah, this was my favorite out of all of them. So I really, really like it. But I'm gonna go back into the skin details and I don't know, just try to like switch it up. Oh, I kind of like this. That kind of looked more realistic already with like the mini freckles. Okay, okay. Do I have anything else? Ooh, this adds like more freckles. Do I want to give her more? <gasps> this nose contour. I'm fucking obsessed. I'm fucking obsessed. Oh my god. Okay, snatched her whole fucking face in. Now I'm obsessed and living. Oh my god. Okay. I feel like I made her face so fucking pretty. I love the way she looks. Do, do, do. Oh my God, and these cute little earrings. Oh my God, cute. They look so good. Okay, Um. Hmm. what am I gonna do? This was the body type that she just came in with. I think I'm gonna keep it. Beautiful bodzy. All bodies are beautiful. So I don't, I don't know. I don't feel the need to change anything. I do kind of want to give her like a fun kind of cutout top. Not necessarily a denim, but I don't know. I've been sore obsessed with cutout tops lately. Oh my God, that is, I could be boring and do like a black top and then like some jeans or something. I don't know, let's play with some print. Let's get fun for the new year, even though I don't fucking know anything. You would think that years after playing The Sims, I would have like some kind of ability to make outfits that like look kind of good, but this is the best that I can do. Like I'm trying to use the CC that I never fucking touch. I can tell you guys confidently, I have never, ever, ever touched this top or these pants before. Don't even ask me how it got in my mods folder. Ooh, is this cute? She's really saying, hmm, wait. Why do I love these white pants on her? <gasps> wait, is this a look? I don't know if this is a look, I'm scared. Okay, you know what, I like the pants. We're gonna look for a different top, Um, but the pants are, Dang. Oh, this is cute. 
But it's so basic. Like, it's literally giving, like, front of Shein or some shit. Like, it's super fucking cute. Don't get me wrong. I would wear it. But I'm literally saying, like, oh, my God. I have to, like, go all out and make this make this sim look, like, super unique. Da -da 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 -da. I don't know. I'm not good at this anymore. But who is to say if I'm good or not? It's my fucking sim. Ooh, I actually like this top a lot more. The Gucci. <gasps> I like the color, but I don't know. I'm not, like, a huge, like, designer. Like, Gucci. Man. I really like the all white. Ooh, it's shiny. Y'all, this is a problem. I really don't know what to put on her. I literally have so much fucking CC. Like, the fuck is this? Why is it locked? I want it. That's from a pack and I pay for it. I'm going to be mad. Why am I locked out? I literally just want her to wear this at this point. Fuck it. You're going to dress like a hoe because hoes have more fun in life. Trust me, if you have hoe friends, you know, they do not judge you. You have better times with everything and they convince you to make bad decisions. So fuck it. Get you some hoe friends in 2020. Ew. It feels gross to say that year. Oh my God. The other day I got a hate comment from someone whose fucking age was in their bio and it literally said 2009. Yeah. I never felt older in my entire fucking life. <laughs> but anyways, um, what do I throw on you? Yes, that chain fits you so good. I don't know. All I know is that I need to get new CC. Oh my God. It's actually going to be kind of sad that all this CC is just going to like go into the abyss and just get deleted and never used again. Just because I'm too lazy to clean out my CC. Can you blame me? Hoes don't get work done, bitch. If you're a hoe and you know how to multitask, Oh my god. Okay, I kind of like these tinier lashes a little bit better on her. Ooh, or even that. I feel like that's kind of fun. And then maybe I could match it with like some eyeliner that also goes on the bottom. Okay, for once, Max's match is actually coming through. Okay, this is a sim that I created. I actually really, really like her. I would love to be friends with her. I feel like she's just, she's giving me like, Pisces vibes and I absolutely love Pisces. I love her side profile. The only thing that I don't like is her ear. Don't really know what's going on over there, babes, but something's happening. But I think she's gorgeous. This is the first time in a really long time that I've made like a sim with shorter hair and you know, more colorful makeup. So I hope you guys like the way that she looks and RIP to all of this CC. But I will talk to you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. And thank you so much to Discord for sponsoring this video. Make sure that you guys check out my server down below. And I will talk to y'all tomorrow. So goodbye, bodies.